What's up, my Jefferson Jewels? This is Baby Girl. And your boy, Revy Reb. I'm behind the scenes today, but Reb is back in the kitchen cooking again. Reb, what are you cooking today? Today, we'll be cooking some egg rolls. Mm. Now, I'm just going to show y'all how I do my egg rolls, okay? Everybody does it different, but this is my way. And when you try it, you're going to see Reb. You're on to something there. All right, so... What I got here, I'm gonna make some chicken egg rolls. I got the I got my chicken already cut up. Y'all, I don't have to show y'all how to cut chicken. You already know how to cut the chicken. Just chicken it, cut it up real fine, make it real fine so it fit in the egg roll real nice. Then I got some, then I got my my onions. I got the onion over here, and I got some my minced garlic. I'm gonna use just a little bit of garlic, not much. Then See, I'm going the smart way. I ain't gonna be out here chopping up all the uh, cabbage and stuff and the carrots. I already got it pre-chopped with the tricolor coleslaw. That's all it is, just some coleslaw uh, in the inside the filling. And then you wanna also get your egg roll wrap. You get it at any one of your corner, uh, one of your grocery stores, uh, mainly the big main main grocery stores, and uh, they always have them. Uh, get your uh, egg roll wrap and that's pretty much all you're gonna need and we gonna get started here now what I, I do have to tell you this you see I'm gonna just put a little grease in here just to yep we ready <laughs> y'all see it I love when my skillet talk to me come on Rev put it in fry that chicken don't you worry, don't you fret. I'm going to put it uh, Now, it's up to you if you want to put some seasoning on your chicken or not. And y'all know I'm, a, I'm one. I ain't going to put too much seasoning on, on the stuff now. Okay, I'm going to put a little, just a little Lowry salt on it. Yes, a little. Man, I'm about to turn that down a little bit. I'm gonna turn that down a little bit lower, isn't it? Okay, we're going. Now we're gonna put some of the onion. Okay, all you all don't know, my onion is my onion. All right, now we go. Let's do it already. Then we're going to put uh, just a pinch of garlic. Two pinches. All right. Now we got all the ingredients in there. And we're just going to let it simmer. Simmer. To, ooh, that smells good, y'all. Mm -hmm. That smells good. Mmm. I'm ready to start tasting now. Now, I'm going to show y'all two ways to do this. I'm going to show you how to do it by adding, uh, okay, what I'm going to do, what I need to do then, I'm going to do that. I'm going to show you all two ways to do this. I'm going to show you how to do it by adding the uh, other ingredients in here, and then I'm going to show you how I used to do it by just putting it in the, in the egg roll. Now, the first way that I'm going to show you is going to take a little bit longer. And what I would have to do is, the first way I'm going to show you is going to take a little longer. And I, I would have to uh, put it in the freezer. So I'm going to take some out so I can show you all both ways. Let's 
see, y'all get a two for one lesson today. Two for one. I could have made this two videos. I'm gonna make it one, two for one. So now, uh, I'm also. But you also you want to you want to rinse your rinse everything off. You got that simmering, so now I rinse this off, and I'm gonna add some some of the coleslaw filling to it. And we're gonna let that cook for a little bit. Just we'll start getting a little flimsy. And once it starts getting a little flimsy, then we're gonna take it off the eye. And doing it this way, you also have to, once you take it off the eye, you, you need to put it in the uh need to put it in the freezer for about 30 minutes and put it in the freezer for about 30 minutes and let it cool off and then you can make your wrap but this other way I'm about to show you and I need to get my file on the other side ready Softer. Ooh, this is gonna be good. Much pepper, but a little pepper. And then you also put your little soy sauce. Okay. Now notice that wasn't much soy sauce, just enough to give it some flavor. Then hold tight, hold tight. It's only if you want to, just a couple of pinches of some sugar. Add another flavor to it. All right, y'all. We getting it in. We then got it cooked down. Ooh. Y'all gonna say, y'all, Rev trying to put the Chinese folks out of business. No, I ain't trying to put them out of business. I'm just trying to help y'all save some money. That's all. During, during this pandemic. Let's see that. I'm not quite ready. We're gonna switch this one over here because it's a bigger fry. And we're gonna take this one. That's a little hot, y'all. Uh, okay. We're gonna take this and y'all hold that thought. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to take this out and put it in another bowl. See, baby girl got me in the kitchen barefoot. Barefoot, but I ain't pregnant. <laughs> uh. Oop, I put one more in there. That's the one I want to put in there. Okay, we're gonna put this in here. We're going to put this in the oven for about 30 minutes. And this goes in the freezer. And there. Ooh, all this food we done bought for this pandemic, we ain't got room in the freezer. Mm -hmm. Now, how about this? 
why don't we just cut and come back? When we come back and then we can just cook them all at one time. We'll see y'all back in 30 minutes. Okay. Okay, now we got the the other mixture uh, in the freezer cooling off. Uh, close to being done. So what I want to do is I want to show you all the easiest way to make the, the egg rolls. Now, we have the egg, hence the name egg roll. All right. So now what you want to do is you want to take and kind of go around the edges and this is almost like a, a sealer for the egg roll and what it does is that this is going to stop the, the grease from coming in and the food from coming out all right so we uh, put egg on all four sides Yes, yes, Lord. We got it going on over here. We gonna be eating egg roll tomorrow in my Bernie Mac voice. <laughs> eating egg rolls tonight. So I know about Bernie Mac from my hometown. I'm gonna put some uh, some of the little meat in there first. I see that. Gonna get some meat in everybody. How about that? How you did it. Then you're gonna put the coleslaw mixture. You're gonna have it nice and thick. And voila. We're gonna put the grease back on the stove. Now, what you want? Did I do that? Okay. You want to put it catty corner. See how that how that is the, in the corner, catty corner like. Then you want to take one roll. Don't roll it too tight or it will break. Then you want to bring it over. Have that little flap there. Press it down. Bring this one over. Press it down. And continue your roll. And voila, we have egg roll. Now let's get this other one going. Because my grease is over there talking to me. And just want to make sure we got a little meat and everybody. And what I did too was I let the meat cool off. And then put some more. I hate to eat the crunch on that big piece. And so we're gonna kind of bring it back a little bit. We're gonna roll, roll, roll your egg. Fold it at the end. Merrily, 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 merrily. Life is nothing but egg, bro. <laughs> How you like me now? All right. Okay, we got the egg roll rolling. We're going to get my grease talking to me. How you there? Okay. Make sure we got them all rolled and sealed. And let's see. I'm going to test it one more time. Yeah. We ready. So, now we're going to... Let's drop the egg roll in and see what we come up with. See how we do, boo boo. While that is doing that, I'm going to rest this on. Uh, let's see. Let's see how it goes. Alright. 
pan they're going to want to dip over. So I'm going to just cook one side first and then I'm going to cook the other side. Sometimes when you do the egg roll, that joke just don't want to flip and stay flipped. So sometimes you have to hold it until it starts cooking on that side. Which is, that's what I'm doing right now. And then once. Tell y'all, I, I love to use peanut oil because the peanut oil usually drains all the way back up. I use peanut oil also when I'm deep frying turkey. That's what I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to show y'all my deep frying turkey. Mm -hmm. Y'all might as well get ready. Y'all might as well get ready. Okay, so we got two. I'm done, y'all. Not cute, but it looks good to me. Egg rolls. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm going to do a couple of more. That's the only bad thing about this is when they don't float right, you can't do that many at a time. Try to get four going. How about that? Now, what I'm gonna do now is, I think I'm going to bring out what I had in the freezer. So now we did the easy ones. Now we're gonna do the ones that take a little bit longer, and those are the ones that I uh, put in the freezer. Now I think what I'm gonna do is. Fingers. Fingers are very clean. One thing you, you'll know about me is when I'm in the kitchen, I guarantee you I don't wash my hand about 20, 30 times. Okay, now we're going. This is the one that's already got everything mixed together. And we're going to see what we're working with with this. This looks like it's going to be good too. Roll, 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 yeah, yeah. Yes, yes, Lord. And look at that. Egg is rolled. Now, let's do the next one.
ends. Don't forget to do the ends. Let's roll this. So this is probably going to be one of your quickest meals that you can make. Say, Rev, you've been at this about 30 minutes. But it's, <laughs> once you get it started, there's nothing to it but to do it. It just seals everything in. Now remember that now. Don't forget the egg. That's, that's the seller. Alright. I know what I'm going to have to do. I'm going to have to go get me one of those little brushes. So I can just brush this stuff on. Oh! We have lost that one. But y'all know I clean my stove all the time, so it's still good. All right, we got a couple of them done. There we go. Fill her up. It's like we was at the gas station. Fill her up. Okay, y'all. So, been in the kitchen cooking. We got the egg rolls. Now, the final results. Voila. Eggs are rolled. Egg roll. Okay, y'all. Now, I gave y'all my recipe on how to do the egg roll. I gave you the long version and the short version. So, pick which one you want to go with. Either way, you can't, make, you can't make a mistake. You can't go wrong either way you go. So, just try it out. Leave a comment, like, subscribe. But most of all, don't forget to subscribe. Subscribe and subscribe. Tell a friend to tell a friend that the Jeffers, the Life with the Jeffersons on YouTube. Until the next time, peace.